Hello. <laughs> Number one, Happy New Year. Uh, get back safe. And uh, the reason y'all are doing what you're doing is allowing us to live the way we live. So uh, we wouldn't be able to do what we do without your service. So thank you. I mean, I hope that uh, if you do get a chance to see this movie, that uh, you'll relate to it, you'll think there's some truth, and that hopefully that others, you know, I mean, we do live in an, in an age where movies, for better or for worse, have, can have a huge impact. And if some people can understand that the sacrifice uh, of a warrior, of someone who decides to give up their life for their country, what that actually means on a day-to-day -day level, not only for them, but for their families, well, you know, it was an interesting road. I mean, uh, when I first uh, was interested in the project, it was in tandem with Chris Kyle. He was alive, very much alive, and um, he had written an autobiography called American Sniper, and uh, I love that war genre uh, ever since I was a kid, um, sort of obsessed with it, and I thought I hadn't really seen a character study uh, lately uh, within, within that genre, and I thought he was such a dynamic, charismatic individual, and ripe for cinema, as is Ta, Ta Kyle. Clint and I just decided that, uh, that we wanted to make this a, a pure character study. And, and if we got it right to any degree, uh, hopefully it could serve two purposes. One would be that those men and women who serve can relate to it and maybe not feel so alone by their plight. And the other, the other would be the 99% of America that, that have no idea what it's like or know anybody in the military uh, would say, wow, maybe the person that passed me in the airport, I'm going to stop and not just say thank you for your service, which does mean a lot, but take it a step further because uh, our vets are coming home in a greater number than ever before. Thank you for your service. And uh, again, you know, uh, uh, what you do is something that I don't think many people even can fathom. Uh, and uh, we owe our freedom and our liberty to you. So thank you.